my best to <laughs> not talk too much. Uh, okay, so this chapter, uh, uh, many of you uh, did online trade. Uh, I'm surprised the, the, uh, even the worst question, I have 94% correct. To, uh, uh, okay, so I guess many of you are uh, aware of uh, Let's just review the. <coughs> Uh, yeah, not all of you finish it, but I will be opening before the exam, so you can hopefully review the action. Okay. What? Uh, let's, let's discuss later on. Uh, can you value the recorded exam? Okay. So, okay. So this, this uh, chapter is uh, kind of a review about the first chapter. It's also uh, one of the key things about the phylogeny that's part I want to emphasize. So, uh, if you have your clicker, uh, the first, oh, sorry, I guess the answer is already there. <laughs> just realized. <laughs> but, okay, well, well, the earth is how many billion years old? 4.6. I guess I still should. <laughs> so, uh, it's 4.5. Uh, but then, uh, okay, so A, uh, microbial life is, uh, how, uh, say, uh, 4, B is 3, C is 2, uh, D is 1 billion years. So the, the life has been, how, many, how long is this? If I, if I open how long has, uh, so, so the earth, yeah, if you, I, 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 I often don't click it. This, this presentation, I, I just amazed how if, if you think about the, it takes so much long to evolve from single cell to eukaryotic cell to human, it actually didn't take much time to, to for life to come from those inorganic things to uh, cellular things. It's quite amazing. Uh, in fact, uh, let's do this exercise. Uh, if, if this is uh, a clock, if this is a uh, clock, uh, what's the question? Uh, I should say, uh, <coughs> uh, so <coughs> we move the, this to the side. So So basically, if the whole uh, history of planet Earth, uh, if if Earth uh, history changed to one day, 24 hours, and how long will the human history be? How long will the So, yeah. Uh, 
let's let's say the human is uh, how how long should the, the human history be? The the civilized human history. Let's let's say uh, like ten, a hundred thousand years. That's actually <coughs> pretty long. <coughs> if, if you just count after Christ, that's even shorter. Yeah. <coughs> so let's see. How do we do this? Uh, oh, I'm sorry. I, I should have put out a PowerPoint, I guess. <coughs> so the entire human uh, entire planet Earth, let's say that's five billion years. Just make it easy. Uh, Ah, let's make it precise. 4.5 billion years. 4 billion years is 10 to the... It's a 9, right? Yeah. 9 years. And each year is, let's say, 365 days. Right. And each day is uh, 24 hours. Right, so... That's the... Uh, that's the Earth, and then we convert this into one day, which is uh, 24 hours. <coughs> and then uh, a human is uh, uh, a 10 to the fifth year, and one says five, on, and this is convert to how long is that? <coughs> So, and by some ratio, by some ratio, say K, uh, by another, by the same ratio, right? <coughs> How do we do this? Uh, so we can just divide these two, right? So, and then all those K will, that's basically. And those and those will be cancelled out. Those will be cancelled out. <coughs> so let me see. So how about you? How about you? When work out on your uh, piece of paper, and then I put this. I'm going to also calculate on my own. Uh, <coughs> I, I'm also going to calculate this on my own, see what's the result. will be ours, Wow. 
sometimes be quite surprised by my own calculation. Now, see, okay, uh, I'm going to pull, uh, give you a few choices. Uh, a, A, two hours, B, two minutes, C, two seconds. I'm not sure whether I did it right or not, but uh, Times sixty thirty six hundred seconds. So, so if you change an hour to sec to minutes, it should time sixty. Change an hour to second, it should time another sixty. So, uh, oh, I still see one response. Uh, <coughs> So basically, if the entire uh, planet <coughs> Earth is treated as one day, how long is our human history will be? Right. So this is the uh, 4.5 billion years in the entire planet Earth. Is the human history? Well, it depends how we count our history. If it's out of Africa, it's about 100,000 years. <coughs> if you just count civilized history, probably even even shorter. So 
but let's use a hundred thousand here. And the Earth basically now become a uh, one day, and then how long is our human history will be if the Earth become one day? Uh, if you Google it, you probably can find an answer on this because someone has done this similar calculation before. Uh, that doesn't look like the right number. Uh, that's too, 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 too high. <coughs> uh, okay, I've got seven responses. Uh, let, let, let's, let's, let's put the response and then see what the uh, uh, prime is. Uh, oh, already 10. Uh, okay. Okay, I, well, wow. <laughs> that, that's good enough. Okay, let's see. So, yay, so, uh, so six of you say it's two seconds. That's what I got too. Uh, so some of you also split up. So why is two seconds? Uh, let, let's work this one out. That's what I... <coughs> Right, so <coughs> I basically have uh, 24 hours, uh, so move X here, <coughs> divided by uh, uh, 4.5 times, okay, times 10 to the first. This is hours, right? This is hours. Uh, so and this will cancel out, that will be 10 to the 4. Right. So that's okay to be a very small number, and then I times 60, and this won't be hour, this will be minute. Right. And then I time another 60, oh, it will be seconds. Yeah. Right. And, and then I got it about two seconds, if I calculate this. Oh, so you changed it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, which is, uh, so yeah, if this is one day, I and mean, human just occur in the last two seconds. Yeah. So if the entire planet is like one day movie, uh, we human actually occur in the last two seconds. So as uh, we actually already done pretty change the planet a lot. <laughs> in, that, in this two seconds, we, we change a lot of things. So, yeah. Okay, so <coughs> I thought this is a fun exercise. But, uh, <coughs> Yeah, it's, it's actually shocking how much we have to do with this two seconds, I guess. In fact, uh, the civilized history is even shorter than that. Okay, so... Light is really one of the, I guess, earliest uh, fortified uh, evidence of life on this planet. So, uh, so I guess when, when you go to the museum, that's probably the, the evidence you will see. Uh, I actually just took my daughter to some natural history museum, so I, I, I don't think she appreciated it. <laughs> I, I found it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So the the earliest uh, uh, evidence like and this stromatolite can is actually in rocks almost three point five billion years old. So those are some evidence of life. Uh, <coughs> well, there's no oxygen there, right? So they cannot be uh, uh, the modern species. And those are actually some of the fossil records look like. So this should be an easy pool, I guess. Uh, most of you already answered the question. So the early early planet uh, A will be uh, hot, B will be cooler. Uh, so how do I? 
this is one of the first questions. Oh, okay. Now, <clears throat> this should be an even question. Especially <clears throat> now that the big band has become a, <laughs> a word that we want to connect to. <laughs> so, uh, okay, let's see. Uh, yeah, it should be hard here. Yeah. So, that's where the others work. There's a, a frequent eruption of a kind of thing. Earth is not also uh, completely cool yet. Yeah, so. <coughs> okay. Uh, <coughs> so, I guess uh, if I just uh, heard of uh, one of those uh, ways, so what is uh, someone? someone should, Send me a picture. What is the scientific way of doing things? Uh, they say every child actually already know how to investigate things scientifically. Uh, they say a baby uh, can can if he's curious, he form a hypothesis and grab something. And if they eat it, that's basically doing some experiment. If they start to cry, they means they are reporting what they are finding. And they, if they share it with their sister, brother. That's also asking for peer review. <laughs> so, uh, but, uh, someone actually did show. If you Google, you probably can find this picture. <laughs> so, uh, I guess uh, if you if you think about how we come up with all those explanations, it basically goes back to this ultimate uh, curiosity: why we we why there's a human on this planet Earth? I mean. So this is basically, uh, most people agree that's the general consensus. Uh, so <coughs> it's, uh, the earliest form of a molecule is RNA, so RNA word. And after that is uh, a DNA. And then the last common, uh, last, uh, 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 common as, uh, what is U again? Uh, uh, universal. universal, that's right, yeah. That's the universal common ancestor. Uh, I, I think I think you're joking a lot of choice. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I, I just run out of uh, options. So I, let's just have a, give a joke. <laughs> but then I also forget what you said. <laughs> Sorry about that. <laughs> Okay, so so after that, you see the, the uh, bacteria, the archaea, there's no eukarya. So the eukarya come uh, very, very late after this. Uh, <coughs> uh, last universe, thank you. Uh, I really need to figure out better mnemonic to remember this. Uh. <coughs> okay. And uh, since there's no oxygen, uh, there's no organic. So the, the most likely the earliest lifespan will be earliest the life form will be. They cannot be organic so, so, because it's chemolytho. I, I I didn't know. So, yeah. <coughs> so they have to opt. Uh, uh, let me see that. Okay, yeah. We have to uh, obtain energy from this uh, in, in, in uh, different ways. So. So a so uh, it, it looked like as soon as the life uh, started, it had already had two different forms, bacteria and archaea. Uh, <coughs> hmm. So okay, this is a good uh, good way to start mm -hmm. for now. Uh, oh, I have to. 
come up with that story. Uh, which, bac uh, which bacteria uh, we think uh, bacteria proteal uh, proteal uh, bacteria Okay, let's just give this three choices. Uh, 2.7 billion years ago, these bacteria developed a further system that could use uh, water instead of the uh, sulfide generating composition. So basically, without that bacteria, we won't even survive, right? They, they, they won't be us. Because without it, there should be no oxygen on the on Earth. And then we, we need oxygen to survive. So. The, yeah, cyanobacteria. That should be the cyanobacteria. Oops. Uh, yeah. <coughs> Uh, even though we, we say the uh, plants are the major source of uh, oxygen nowadays, but without cyanobacteria, there will be no oxygen. Uh, okay, so why? Uh, what does this figure show us? What, what's the difference between the left figure and the right figure? So this is a, this is a figure about the uh, origin of a chloroplast and the mitochondria. It's basically the origin of the eukaryotic system. So, <coughs> so if you recall, this is where the split between the bacteria and archaea that's that's uh, occur almost as soon as uh, 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 about the, the Earth, Earth started about that's about four billion years as occurred here, but the, uh, the eukary actually occurred much later, uh, and then not all eukary actually have uh, have mitochondria. So this is basically explain why we have a mitochondria uh, for plants. Why we uh, why plants have a chloroplast. <coughs> so, I actually, uh, <coughs> when I was a student, the right figure actually did not even exist. The, the, the figure on the right uh, exists uh, after uh, uh, 1998, uh, when, when a person called uh, uh, William Martin, Bill Martin, uh, he, he is actually American, but uh, uh, now uh, he's a professor in Germany. I actually met this guy at a conference. <coughs> uh, the, way, uh, the way I met this guy uh, is very entertaining. So, probably, uh, so I arrived very late at a conference, uh, uh, <coughs> it's almost uh, 11 or probably at night. So people trying to check in or something, and then even the front desk are closed. And then uh, even later, someone uh, someone coming in a police squad car, and this guy uh, walking out and with a bottle of red wine in his hand, <laughs> and he coming in <laughs> and sharing the red wine with people, and say, oh, sorry, I come in late, <laughs> but I have this European. <laughs> And that's Bill Martin. <laughs> and, uh, I mean, we were actually at a college, uh, uh, living in a dorm. But there's no, uh, the, since the front desk is closed, he, he has to call the police, and there's no taxi around. <laughs> and the police actually let him in just drinking the wine. <laughs> Which is uh, that's really funny. <laughs> 
and the, yeah. But that's the guy actually responsible for this figure right here. So, <laughs> so that he he proposed something called a hydrogen hypothesis. Uh, so before all the textbook use this one. Who is the person responsible for this figure? Uh, do, do you guys do you guys know Carl Sagan? The, the one who wrote the movie like uh, Sphere. Uh, I guess he, he, is, he died now. Uh, but Carl Sagan is actually Carl Sagan's wife is called. Uh, but Carl uh, uh, Sagan's wife. Uh, sorry. You, you have the textbook, can you Google uh, endosymbiotic hypothesis? Uh, if you Google, you will see a person's uh, video on Wikipedia, you will tell you the person's name. It's a uh, Carl Sagan's wife who teaches at the University of uh, Massachusetts Amherst. I forgot. Uh, uh, Matt, uh, Matt or something. Uh, but that's the so on the left is the the traditional endosymbiotic hypothesis. On the right is the hydrogen hypothesis. <coughs> on the left, basically say, well, uh, there is a, a some eukaryote here had to eat some bacteria on the on this branch, and that is on the mitochondria. <coughs> on the right one says the. <coughs> on the right one, the, that crazy German guy says uh, it's probably unlikely this will happen, but it, it probably happened already in this lineage already. So the uh, the eukaryote already have an endosymbiotic bacteria inside of it. That's called hydrogen. So, uh, <coughs> so Uh, this is called a hydrogen hypothesis. So on the left one is this one. Uh, <coughs> acquire mitochondria by, by uh, somehow uh, eating a bacteria. And the <coughs> on the left one, basically, it started off. It already started with one. So. Okay, so <coughs> how do how do you think this tree is generated? If we want to pick a gene to generate this tree, those are all gene trees. What kind of gene should we pick? If, if, you, if, you, if I give you the job, say, describe a, describe a tree, uh, uh, generate a tree, describe all the species on planet Earth, which gene are you going to pick? You want to pick the gene exists in every species. That's the most conservative. If you pick a gene only exists in human but not in bacteria, then you are not going to have a, a figure who describe every species. <coughs> so it turns out uh, <coughs> this is the so if you want to generate a tree, we have to use some the the protein translation is the, that's the most conserved uh, uh, component, and protein translation will use RNA as part of the component. So ribosomal RNA is actually <coughs> the one of the most conserved components. So we small ribosomal unit uh, RNA gene is actually the one we use to generate the tree. Uh, actually. Uh, work on this, uh, <coughs> I spent almost two and a half years working on this. Uh, <coughs> so, but, so this is a guy, uh, Carl Woos is one of the first person to start this. Yeah, uh, he also responsible for many of the, he also responsible for the archaea to be a separate form of life. 
So this guy, uh, he actually is not well, uh, uh, his idea is not well recognized or received for almost 20 years. Uh, but eventually, I guess, truth will prevail, even though I mean, people don't like it. So, <coughs> so actually, yeah. So small sub subunit RNA is the main gene we use to generate all the trees. <coughs> Okay, so there's also a tool on um, how do we find all the genes in all, all the uh, genomes. There's also a tool called BLAST. Uh, in fact, if you Google BLAST, you will, you will probably find it. So here's an example of how BLAST works. So I, ha I have three sequences here. This is basically called sequence alignment. So I have, so there are highways. Uh, between Atlanta and Nashville, there are flights between Atlanta and Nashville, there are a few flights between how, how do you think these two sequences will be aligned if, if you if you run a blast search on these sequences? And this is actually how it will be aligned between the first <coughs> and second uh, sentences. So so see they are uh, Apparently, those are all amino acid. So, <coughs> so the so IGH actually aligned with uh, there's a gap here between high and the fly, and so that's a put a gap. But there's also and then there's uh, as the the rest of them will be aligned for it. Right. So, so what what the blast do is uh, there's a very important concept called war. So blast basically first look for war. And then align them. So it basically looking for shared world. This is how the second and third are aligned. So you still see the IGH here, and then here you see A A N and A N T, but there's an A G gap here. Right? <coughs> so. so here's actually a. The basic idea of how the blast work. Blast search for the, the central idea of blast work is basically to look for pair of world, to align by world and then expand to the side. So in this way, you're going to identify a world so IGH, but when you try to expand, it didn't go much. Uh, on the right, you see if. If here we see a word, if we expand to the right, we can goes right. So V, I, L, L, they all align. Right? And then it goes to the left, it goes all the way to air, and then say, well, now this cannot be aligned, so that's very careful. <coughs> so that's basically the so of last word. <coughs> Criteria for blast is called e-value and a score. So, okay, <coughs> phylogenetic tree. And once we have sequence, we can use that to generate phylogenetic trees. Uh, many of you, I, I think we went through this before, but here's an interesting exercise. So here is the rooting and unrooting trees. So. <coughs> If we want to say life start with somewhere, we have to put a root on it. But usually we don't. So here. So if I want to put a root here, how will that tree be look like? Uh, If I want to put the root here, how how would you redraw this tree? Uh, actually, have a uh, some Play-Doh here for you to do this. So you can you can, you can take some Play-Doh and uh, 
generate a tree and see how it look like. So, you mean like the retarded? So, let me also. <coughs> so, I guess I. Uh, I feel like this is real. The, the board is too slow to put a plate It's not as soft as it's not like that. Mine feels really soft. Oh, we should have a You are not that's what I know. Hi. Hi. <laughs> 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 what? You got the good plate on. He is. Oh. I don't have a plate over that. My arms hurt. I never got a Okay. So, I, I, I got the tray like this, right? Okay. You got a little uh, Oh, so I love that. The, 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 the <laughs> <laughs> uh, Look, like the more, <coughs> the more it's breaking. Love your plate. My plate don't love me. I love you. It's just. <laughs> I like this class though. She should play with the plate. And learn. Start wearing your mask for the Are you? Are you? Wait. <laughs> No, but her voice is retarded. You know, my pen is better. You better get it. Yeah. With your different modes of learning. You big one. I'm all three. You're all three? Mm. So you gotta hear it, gotta see it, gotta do it. Need some more moisture. <laughs> <laughs> see, this is how Play Doh is supposed to feel. Oh, Kool-Aid, not Play-Doh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, oh. <laughs> I know you guys are <laughs> Nobody ever said that. Oh, mine is cracking, too. Dr. Chen, I think you're hiding oh, all the good Play-Doh over there. I play don't want to stay in the world. Oh, so you, you, if you want a several <laughs> color for the nose, you, you, you See, can... how'd you get that, like, black? Uh, yeah, I'm going to label it on the, oh, okay. on the okay. board. So I have the one as pink. Uh, I actually don't have a pink, so I'm going to label red. Uh, 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 it wasn't me. It wasn't me. I, I was showing all the love I had. One, so. Yeah, I'm not uh, giving any love. Number two is yellow. <coughs> green is the uh, number three. Well, my plate don't want to stay together well, huh? So I don't know. She's struggling here. She said, did you? Brown is number five. Uh, pinkish, pinkish blue, blue is number four. You know what? Right, so, just attach it here. <coughs> I need love and a bitch. And if I want to put the... So here's my tree now. So Here's my tree now. So I want to put the root here. Right. So... <coughs> And then I basically, if, if this is my root, I basically uh, put everything and smooth everything upwards. Okay. okay. So put everything upwards. And, and basically, ah, let me see. Move this a little more. So I basically going to pull this downwards and 
pull everything upwards. Right, so. I feel like this is equivalent to a magic school bus. Like how those kids smell them every day. Okay, so how about these trees look like for you now? And then we're changing. Oops. Uh, oh my god, I have so many videos. So, <coughs> my kids watch my okay, so oh, this is basically what happened after I. And Bill Nye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, very good. Yeah, so, I, so I, how do I, how do, I uh, do this? I basically pull this down and then put everything upward. Right? So, so I'm going to. Um, Just kind of <coughs> right, so yeah, I, I, I can. I'm going to grab this one and pull it down. Uh, uh, so this will be pulled down. Oh, one of my. Right. So pull down. So uh, this is my rule. And then I'm going to put everything smooth it to the top. Right, so. Yes, I put. I it. So. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Right. And then this will, will be, and then put these two. Uh, Using my techniques for measuring. Mm -hmm. yeah. So <coughs> then I should have a tree like this. Uh, like this? Yeah. Overall. Wait, wait. Let me try to get it. I know. Mine probably all dry. Alright. So this is my. my <laughs> So it's basically going to like this. So, so now if I want to say put the root here, what will happen? If I if I reach all that uh, tree before. If I put the root here, how is that going to look like? Right, between here, between one and the twelve three. <coughs> so, so basically, <coughs> this is the original tree. So this time I'm going to put the root here. Right. Give me a small piece of yours. So I, I, well, I just need to stretch this part, make it uh, longer, and then pull it down. Right. Oh, so. well, you didn't have to make that one. <coughs> it's okay. And actually. See? That's basically how it's going to look like. Okay. So if I put the root between. Oh. Oh no. So so if I put root here and then I try to uh, again I try to pull this one down. Uh, so I pull this one down. Uh, right. And then. So this one down. Uh, one still there. Right. So <coughs> right. So it's right. Then uh, that actually, this should be the final. The play the extra fast. I think it'd be very successful. Right. So this should be something like this. Right. So, right. <laughs> <laughs> you, you you said this should be in the final. Yeah. Event? Everybody grab some Play-Doh, make dreams happen. Uh, I, I can't keep Play-Doh as, as a on the side to exercise. It's oh, hard for you to nice. submit the Play-Doh. Uh, <laughs> I mean, I guess, which, so yeah, you take the picture, submit it on Moodle. Uh, if we just that, that's, yeah, 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 let's go. Oh, okay, I'll put one question there. <laughs> I gave you an unruly tree, you generated a rooted tree, and you have to label the notes though, when to Okay. Put, put the paper label. Uh, let me let me see how I can do this. Uh, see, uh, all you gotta do is can, can you can paper? you put a piece of paper? Say one, two, right? Or A B C D. Or you can do this with a paper. Or you can put on a paper and write it on the side. Yeah. How about that? Right, right, yeah, yeah. And yeah. then take pictures, submit see it. Makes the dream work. How about that? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Good. That's a good idea. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. I, I'm going to remember this next year. Yeah. How about that? Yeah, that's how it is. Yeah, that's how it is. This is our final. And then label with a note. It's a final. Oh, thanks.
I was trying. Uh, I wasn't trying to pay attention. <laughs> <laughs> this is <laughs> yeah. Wait, oh my god. Yeah. 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 Yeah.